Hi everybody. Welcome to day three of my 2019 Halloween special for YouTube. So far in the special, in two games, I've racked up a total of 98,080 points and I'm going to add to it right now with the third game in the special. Really awesome game I'm going to play now. The game is... Castlevania 3, Dracula's Curse. Before we get started with the game, listen to this. During 15th century Europe, there lived, a, there lived a person named Dracula. He practiced sorcery in order to create a bad world filled with evil. He began taking over the continent of Europe, chaining countries from good to bad. The good people of Europe tried to fight off Dracula, but no one was able to survive. Finally, the Belmont family was summoned to battle Dracula's vile forces. The Belmont family has a long history of fighting evil. The townspeople became afraid of the Belmont's superhuman power and asked them to leave the country. Fortunately, the people found a mighty Belmont called Trevor. The curse of Dracula had begun. The fate of Europe lies with Trevor. Alright guys, let's play Castlevania 3. First things first, I'll put in my name. Brett J. J is for Jagger, of course. All right. That must be Trevor there. All right, let's play. Pretty simple game. Got to collect hearts and power-ups and so. Got a special weapon, a knife. Got a big heart, it's worth five. All right, we're in. Bag of money there. Little hearts, of course, worth one. Another bag of money there. Hearts are important, of course. I can believe a level, they can be worth points. Another special weapon, potion. Oops. Doing good. Up we go. He got me, but I got him back. down now. Looks like Medusa's head flying. This game is almost uh, the spitting image of the first Castlevania game. Be careful of those platforms there. Ooh, 
through zombies galore. Special weapon, an axe. Got the cross there, and that'll get rid of all the enemies in sight. Good move there, thanks for the special weapon. are shooting fireballs. Gotta watch out. Now onto the fourth part of level one. Got the cross and I got rid of all the enemies in sight. Five thousand points. You can take on the first boss. I think I'm gonna get him back. Got him. Piece of cake. Get some points for time. And the hearts. Over 10,000 points now. There's the map of Castlevania. We can either go up or down. I think I'll go up. metal room or so. Got the stopwatch. They'll freeze everything for five seconds or so. Couple bags of money there. of power. That got him. Going up. Doing excellent. There's only one way across. Got to get on that pendulum. And another one. Made it through perfectly that time. Got to get on these spinning wheels to the other side. Not easy, but challenging. Medusa's head again. It was the axe. Ooh. points there. I 
keep thinking I can avoid her, but no dice. Two dash three now. Oh! I fell. Let's see if I can redeem myself. There we go. I even lost a few hearts, but that's okay. Still got a good score. jump. This is not an easy level, you know. Gotta be a way across. Good aim. There we go. Oh, it's going down. That time was a bad idea. Going up. Missed me that time. Get to become the next boss. Gotta be careful. Oh, bad move. Game over. Yeah, it wasn't easy, but it was fun. So I finished with a score of 14,010 points. We add that to the total from the previous games. I now have a total of 112,090 points. Well, tough luck, but still fun. Okay, so 14,010 points my final score, and that's it for Castlevania 3, Dracula's Curse for the NES for day 3 of my 4-day Halloween special for YouTube for 2019. And I'll see you guys tomorrow for the 4th and final day of my Halloween special, okay? Alright, so see you guys tomorrow. And remember, video game or not, play hard, and of course, play safe. Thanks for watching. See you guys tomorrow. Bye.